easy. It's not this magical thing that, you know, that will solve all your problems and everything will get done for you, right? SOAR is not a fully automatic security. It's not a threat detection solution. It's definitely not a replacement for your security team. In fact, SOAR is crucial in enhancing and uplifting your security team. And it's not a quick way to set up a SOC team, right? Because a lot of people say, oh, let's put in SOAR. But the reality is SOAR benefits from having a SOC team, right? So what is SOAR all about then? Well, SOAR is a platform that can automate technical and non-technical actions, assisting humans as they perform security operation tasks. So th the norm is, you know, every incident out there, it's you know, the people, the process, and the technology. And that's what SOAR tries to bring in. As what you said, security, the S stands for security, but although all the jobs it automates doesn't necessarily have to be security related, right? So I'll explain it later on the, uh, on the next slide. And then orchestration, the ability to control other devices through technical integrations from one place. So it's kind of like your single pane of glass or your single point to communicate with others. And that alleviates a lot of challenges, especially for MSSPs. Um, automation, it uses scripted actions to carry out pre-programmed responses to, to defined events. So you can, you know, once an alert comes in, you can say like, okay, let's ping, you know, like a Slack channel or a Teams channel. So all of these can be automated. And a response, a desired action to take on set conditions. So every time a condition is made, you know, the basic is like, oh, I found malware on my machine. Let's contain this device, right? So, so that is, you know, what the high level overview of what a SOAR is, right? 